welcome back everyone to another random ass booster box unboxing. Now today we have Kado Kawa Sneaker Bunko. Uh, I've been told that this came out fairly recently and it's very popular in Japan and I've been advised that there are some very expensive hits in this set. Um, we're gonna find out if we'll get lucky and hit any of those. If you've seen my previous unboxings, all my Weiss things are on eBay already, so we'll see if I make any money on that. Um, I don't really know what this is, but I Wikipedia'd it real quick, and apparently it's a line of manga aimed at a male audience, so I'm going to assume that means this is not safe for work. But uh, let's go ahead and see this box. So, looks like we have not that many parallels this time. Looks like it's a 105 card set, um, 30th anniversary, so Katakawa Sneaker Bunko is apparently like um, a brand, not a single anime, and I guess they have some examples of the cards in it on the back here. They don't look that bad, but actually this one looks kind of bad. I guess it remains to be seen what's inside, and I don't really recognize any of these characters except that one. I think that one's very popular. It's um, ha Haruhi Suz Suzuha? Suzuhiya, something like that. And uh, again, I'm not an expert on um, anime anymore. I used to be when I watched them a lot in like high school and stuff, but it's been a long time. So without further ado, let's go ahead and open this bad boy up and hopefully we can pull one of those super valuable SP cards, because those are always worth a fortune in Weiss slash Weeb Schwartz or Weiss Schwartz for you purists out there. I just call it Weiss. So there we go. We have the box. And of course, we have the little promo card that all these things seem to have. So let's go ahead and look at what that is. And uh, that looks pretty benign. Looks like some underage drinking going on, but... um. There we go, that's our promo card. I'm not really sure what anime this is from. I will try to do some research for you guys before I publish this and uh, kind of put it in the black bars below for you fans of anime out there. But uh, without further ado, let's take a quick look at the booster pack. Looks a lot like the booster box art. Um, and we'll go, these packs actually look kind of nice. I like this gold stuff going on. Without further ado, let's get started. Let's see if we could pull anything super spicy in these packs. All right, pack number one. Jesus Christ, okay, all right. This is definitely not safe for work, so. Um, don't know what these things are from at all. Ooh, there we go, rare. So what are these? Um, these are common, so we'll put them off in the common corner. This is a double rare. Again, don't know what anime that's from. Almost looks like Saber or something from Fate Stay Night. This is apparently a compilation of multiple animes. Is that a weird looking Haruhi? I don't really know. Uh, and here we go, regular rare. So I'm gonna try and make separate piles here. And, oh, they started putting these crappy things in the back now. I hate those. And this is, um, I don't know. It's a Climax Common. I don't know what anime this is from. You guys can comment in the sections below if you guys know. And again, I'll try to do some research for you guys. So we'll do uh, alternating. We'll put the rares in the front, commons up here, and the uncommons. And as always, these Weiss Schwartz packs open very nicely. Throw away this little pamphlet thing. Um, again, the Haruhi, Jesus Christ. Now I get why. Um, so some of these are fine, like this is fine. This is kind of... I guess it's not that bad, but like this is impossible, obviously, in real life. Kind of bizarre. Eh, borderline. Okay. Alright, so this... Eh. I mean, it is a double rare. Maybe this one's worth a lot. I don't know what anime these things are from. Which one's the double rare? Uh, this one looks, almost looks like Rin from Fate Stay Night again. I don't know what anime these super inappropriate ones are from. And that's our regular rare. And this one's another Climax Common. That one's pretty normal, so that's fine. Watch, I'm gonna get like banned from YouTube for these stupid unboxings. 
Um, I'm assuming this is from the other perverted anime. This one's kind of cool looking. I don't know what this is from either. Some kind of demon anime, I guess. Got that already. Um, no rare slot in that one? Hmm. Uncommons. And our regular rare. And this... It's like backwards. Um, this is our climax common, if my camera focuses. Some kind of gun anime. I'm confused. Did I skip past the rare in this one? No, I guess not. Hmm. I guess that was a uh, crappy pack. I don't know. I feel like each pack is two foils per box, so I'm going to have to go back and see if I missed it somehow. I think we got this already. All right. Um, no, so I guess they don't always have rares in the middle like that. I think Kono Tsuba's in here, so I recognize those. Uh, rare, meh, borderline, uncommon, and this is our Climax Con. That's kind of cool artwork. It's almost like Fire Emblem or something. All right, so to get this, I've been ordering off uh, Ami, Ami.com. Um, this thing is actually like sold out in a lot of places, so I think the guy was right. These are very popular. Um, I don't know if these anime are very well known in the U.S., but wow, the commons are taking over my rare slots, I think. Um, but you can still get a few of them on eBay. This is our rare. Looks like the girl from uh, Guilty Crown. Climax Common again. So nothing exceptionally good yet, but I did see uh, an SP of, I think, let me just show you the pack after I get this open. I saw an SP on eBay of this one where my thumb is sell for like $250. So yeah, these cards are valuable if you get the right ones. I don't know which ones are like the popular ones, but if you get like a great hit, some of these cards, Jesus, are worth a fortune already. Wow, I'm not. I'm getting really gypped on the. Uh... Is this Konosuba? That I, I think this is Aqua from Konosuba. I'm not sure. I think this is the one where the SP is worth a lot. Not that artwork, but that character. Um, here's our rare. Don't know who that is, but not that bad. And this one. What the hell is? All right, whatever. Okay. All right. I wonder if I could even show those on eBay without getting in trouble. I guess I'll hide that in the listing of the photographs. Uh, that one looks kind of familiar, I don't know. I guess when you watch enough anime, like the anime in different... the characters in different anime all end up kind of looking the same. Wow, I'm only not getting two foils per pack anymore. Maybe it's just the first few packs that do that. Um... Don't know who that is. What the fuck? That's a Climax Rare. I guess she's trying to eat his nipples. Okay. Alright, I'm not really going to try to explain that. I don't even know if I'll publish this video at this rate. I need to see if other people have unboxed this and gotten in trouble or not. Uh, what the? F All right. Um, so we have a climax rare in the middle. So the slots are kind of confusing in this one. I guess that middle slot can be literally anything, like a common rare climax card. Uh, that's our rare. And this one is a climax common. So they all kind of seem to have this theme of some girl assaulting some guy. That one wasn't so bad. At least she was clothed. I hate these things in the back. Like, I don't need a million of them. Common, common. That guy does look familiar. I don't... Is that Aqua again? I can't tell. There we go. So maybe the middle becomes a double rare if you get something. Hmm. I do like the foiling on these. Uh, don't know... Oh, that's like old school ass artwork. That one's kind of cool, actually. 
this is definitely Haruhi. Um, I don't remember the other two's names. And this one's kind of cool looking, actually. Some kind of gun girl anime. Was like Gunslinger Girls. I don't remember. That's like a really old one. All right. And I'll leave in the black bars what anime are included in this. Maybe some of you guys recognize these more. I really only recognize Konosuba and that Haruhi one. What? What is happening? The old school one. It's kind of cool. So the common took my foil slot again. Maybe this box is a bust. Unless I get a random SP later. And when you do get an SP, I feel like it's in like the middle of the box. At least that's what... Is this allowed? It's not censored at all. It's a Climax Rare. I'll censor that for you guys. I guess because it's just like old fake artwork, they decided it's okay to show that. I don't really know. So yes, uh... This is by far the most inappropriate set of cards I've ever opened, which is saying a lot because I've done quite a few Weiss Schwartz ones now for this channel. What the? Um, okay, that one's not that much better. Sadly, this one seems appropriate now. Ooh, it's kind of cool. Uh, uncommon. This guy again looks kind of retarded now that I look at him more carefully. And this must be an older anime, judging on this artwork. I don't know what that is. And I think we've gotten this one already. Climax Common. So again, nothing that great as far as I know. I need to look at the prices of these. I know the SPs are through the roof already. I don't know the pull rates on them. It didn't look like they were SSSP. So you just this, depending on the SP you get, if it's a desirable one, looks like you make a shit ton of money. Uh, rare. Don't know who that is. Uh, I think it's the same girl, actually. And we're already getting near the bottom of the box, and I haven't gotten like a triple rare or a super rare or an SP or anything good. So I think a box does guarantee at least one of those rarities, so I think something good should be coming. Hopefully it's an SP, though. Ah, damn it, it's an SR. Although it is um, Haruhi, I think, so maybe this one will be worth a lot. I need to check TCG Republic. This one's actually kind of cool. I actually like this card. So there's our super rare for the box. Uncommon. And our rare is this girl with this giant gun. And I think this is from, oh, Climax Rare. I didn't realize they had the 30th anniversary batch, so I guess it's like the 30th anniversary of this company or something. Or this manga brand, whatever it is. I don't think it's the actual company, I think it's like a... some umbrella for the series under one big company. Uh, common, 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 common. Double rare. That's cool. I think it's that same elf guy from before. Again, I'm not sure what that's from. Uncommon, uncommon. And I, did we get this one already? I feel like I recognize this elf guy. Ooh, and this cool old school artwork. I actually dig this stuff. It's like watercolor or something. Wait, is that Climax or Climax Common? Common. And last two packs. So I guess that super rare is the best card I'm going to get. I don't remember if like Box is supposed to have like a triple rare and a super rare. I know the sword art ones kind of gypped me. It was just one super rare per box and it was the crappy Elizabeth one. Um, double rare. What's this girl's name? Megu? Megumi? Is this from uh, Konosuba? Not sure. Um, okay. This one is a rare, almost looks like the Shining Resonance art. Uh, okay, was that a rare? No, it's common. All right, last pack, guys. Looks like this box was a complete and total dud, unfortunately. Ugh. Damn it, I think 
this would be the SP slot, so I think I definitely can't get an SP now. Was that an uncommon? Yeah. Uncommon. And that's our rare. This is a, a Climax Common. Uh, okay, I'm not going to talk about that. All right, so let's go over our foily goods. I do like that super rare I got, so that's kind of cool. Again, if you want to buy these, you can find them on eBay. I use AmiAmi. They have great prices and stuff for Japanese products. Um, I don't know if I'll buy these again. Looks like the hit rates aren't too great unless you get lucky. So this is our super rare. Based on the price of this, I'll see if I'm willing to try to get another one of these boxes, but I'm pretty sure I just lost money on this. I paid, uh, for the record, it was 67 minus 8% eBay bucks and 2% credit card, so I paid like 60 bucks flat for this box. That's our super rare, or double rare. I think that's from Konosuba. Don't know what that's from. I think that's someone from Haruhi. Uh, don't know who that's from. Don't know who that's from. This is not going to say that because this assume I don't know what they're from unless I say so. The artwork is good, although it varies wide. Like, look how different the artwork is. Like, this looks so much more modern than this card. I assume it's because it's from multiple sets. Okay, I recognize this cast. I uh, don't remember their names, though. Uh, I, I want to say this is the girl from Guilty Crown, but I don't remember Guilty Crown being the uh, one of the anime listed for this set. God, I don't forget what her, remember what her name is, Yui or something, I don't know. I uh, have no idea who that is. From her outfit, I want to say it's another Haruhi character. Don't know who that is, and definitely don't know who that is, some kind of cat girl anime. Alright, so that was my unboxing of Kadokawa Sneaker Bunko. It was a complete massacre, I don't think I got anything good. Um, if I did get something good based on these cards from TCG Republic, I'll put it in the comment section or the black bars below. So anyways, thanks for watching. If you're interested in picking one of these up, just find it on eBay or AmiAmi.com. And uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Have a great day, guys.